Oh, I wasn't even streaming. Whoops. Oh, that was a mistake. Huh. 1080p? What? Quiet, aren't I? There we go. All better. Just one more thing I gotta do, and then we can start playing. How nice of those monsters to sit there and wait for me, you know? Not every day you meet people as nice as that. Okay, let's see. Never mind. And, uh, they, they like to sit around while I kidnap their friend. <laughs> oh. Okay, I gotta fix the camera. did it. Wow. I'm surprised. I beat the first fight in the game, you know. Um, I'm not gonna skip the cutscenes, I guess. This is my first time streaming this game. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Every time. Instinctively want to skip it, skip it. So I've seen it a million times. Ooh, don't wipe my face with that. Jesus. Dear Mother, how are you? I'm doing fine. So much has happened that I don't know where to start. Well, I guess it's easiest to start at the beginning. It all began that night. Right. That night of the storm. Oh, got right away. Sprinting noise. Man, this game is pretty. Not in higher resolutions. But take a look at this. I've never been able to see the numbers in that cash register. <laughs> Check this out. I got a ticket for Flotsam Circus Troop. Oh, good for you. Your dad's not gonna try to stop you? He said I could go. Well, you'd better finish your work quick then, huh? Right. Hey, Max, what's that you got there? What's this? Father gave it to me yesterday. Always wear it, he said. It's pretty old. I don't know what it is. Hmm. Well, can I get started? Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Gable's vacuum is set up below. Go to it, lad. Leave it to me. I love the outlines on the characters. to change the music.
I'm gonna have to get used to the controls and shit. Stuff. Do you have any saves still? Oh, yeah, I do. <laughs> 502 kilobytes. <laughs> Silly. Oh no! This controller is broken. It doesn't go down right -ish all the way. Oh man, how do I fix that? Rip. every other direction except for down right. It's like, no, I gotta walk. A wrench. Here we go. Ah, this hilarious. is the Anbar Type 2 here. This is a pretty specialized hose attachment. Oh, I see the problem. <laughs> oh, got a message. Everybody ready? Let's have a stupendous show tonight! Let's make this a night of wonder! All right, all. Let's get to work! Ticket to go in. <laughs> yeah, can I go back and talk oh, to him? I can't believe it. Of all the. <sighs> well, hold on, I'm gonna go back to this dude. Said it. See if he says it. You need a ticket to go. You need a. You need a ticket to go in. You need a ticket to go. <laughs> Did you see a little red-headed kid coming this way? Nope. Do you see anything? He headed towards City Hall. This is like one of the only times in the game you can talk to people in the world and they'll have the voice lines. And even Did then, you see a red-haired boy run by? Just now. I'm certain I saw him heading that way. Oh man, this controller is really bad. Yeah, I can't go upright too. I'm gonna have to fix that. 
I'm fixing that right now. Give me a second. I'm sorry. Alright, let's see if that did. And let's see if I'm still... Okay, there we go. Uh, can't go down left. Okay. This game, and it's... This, this controller and it's dumb problems. Okay, let's just set the... Can I set the sensitivity number straight up? No. Nope. Maybe that'll fix it. I'll get lucky. Okay, yeah, it's because down is a higher sensitivity, yep. Okay. Sorry about this, it's just, I, I can't stand having a broken controller. Perfect. That should work. Yeah, there we go. That's way better. Anyway, yeah, if I talk to this NPC over here, she's just like, hey, look at the moon! Tells you that R2 looks. You can see there's two moons! Whoa! Hey! Hey, did you see a red haired boy? Me? No, sorry. I see. You're the chosen one. You gave a ticket to a kid that was homeless. Good job. Also, the kid didn't really exist, so you get your ticket back. Surprisingly, the rich kid being generous. Here it is. Hurry up, it's starting. Yep. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Only two, hey, only three of the characters no here. Oh wait, yeah, three of the anything. characters here have animations. <laughs> Plus Max. Wow! 
the rest of the holes. Textures or whatever. Orgasm. Well, Mayor, you're certainly looking well. <gasps> well, if it isn't my favorite roasted chestnuts, you thought of everything. Huh? What's this about? Oh, mm, this is good. Indeed, this town's chestnuts are the best! Not <laughs> you see. Now, Mayor, are you really trying hard enough? You know what happens if you don't find the stone, <laughs> don't you? Oh, wait, wait, please, I'm trying my best to find it. Please, I need more time. Ah, oh, well, what can you do? But remember, this chance is your last! Are you sure that the stone is in this town? <laughs> oh, I can smell it. I can smell it! The stone is in this town! Absolutely! But we've turned the mine inside out looking for it. We couldn't find a trace. <laughs> oh, sweet mare. We've been through this. I've told you before. I don't tolerate excuses! <laughs> ah, but the people in this town really are living the sweet life, huh? Not knowing anything of the outside world, they're lost in their carefree lives. <laughs> With such a pack of ninnies, no wonder they can't find a single stone. <laughs> You can't tell anyone about the outside. There'd be a panic. Then no one would be able to look for your stone. Oh, I know, Mayor Pooh. We'll keep it our little secret. <laughs> Darn! Who are you? Max, yep. run, hurry!
Sorry about that. Wake up, fools! Did you see it? The red stone around that boy's neck! We found it at last! <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? Get him! Get ready for a buttload of cutscenes. Crazy kid. Cardboard cutouts that can move. That is a big wrench. Where did he even get that? Side. And then fall the one. Camera's so slow. Get this just right. You can throw him and he'll sit on your head. Forgot where to do it now. By the way, yes, you can just do this to him. Oh, I think we got it. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> against uh, against higher level enemies, then struggling will make your health tick down very fast. So you can't just carry him forever. Oh wait, Max can lift uh, really heavy enemies. Like he can lift. Uh, Gigantic chunks of rock. I won't try and spoil anything, but there's an enemy that is just a gigantic chunk of rock. You can lift that and move just about as fast as this. 
They also toss it like, about that far. So yeah, Max is crazy. Monica can do the same, only Monica has a slower lifting animation, so she's All right. not the Guess this will character. have to do. <laughs> Still only two characters with animation. <laughs> Who is ready for more huffing? Wait, not the drug kind. Shall we begin then? This game is that the best voice acting is on every other character except for the main characters. It'd probably be better if this was uh, in Japanese. I don't, I don't want to bother getting Japanese copy. Probably don't exist anymore anyway. Okay, I gotta stop messing with that. Problem the hell out of you guys. Oh, what now? Kill it. Hand over the pendant, boy! Hand it over now, and I'll let you leave here alive. Pendant? What, this? Don't do it! Magic boy. Huh? Well, what's it gonna be? You can't give it to him. It's too important. Hand it over! No! No! I won't! Well, if it's going to be that way, then die! Yeah, there is. You idiot! He's behind you! Quickly, after him! Max! This way! So he fell down that manhole, right? I was so scared then. But in a way, it was really fun. Uh-oh, pre-rendered cutscene. You can tell because it got really blurry. I mean, every boring day had been just the same for me. But this, this was the beginning of a real adventure. I'll take my chances. Probably copyrighted. Dude, spoilers! Come on! Oh, hey, come on, you see You guys, awesome. 
Circus troop. Why are they after you? I think I heard something I wasn't supposed to. I didn't understand exactly what was going on. But I needed to get out of there. Yeah. Tony, what is this place? It's the underground water channel supplying the town. Really? Yes. You, you could also call it my secret base. Wow. <laughs> oh, I never knew this place existed. Not too bad, huh? Those clowns will never find you here. Just relax. Yeah. Go ahead and save because this game is crashing. Tommy's tent. There's a lantern inside. That's it. There's some uh, soup. So this goes outside of the town, right? Hmm? Yeah, I guess. Exactly. Exactly what? Hey, Max, what are you cooking up? Something's going on in the outside world. What? That flotsam guy is threatening the mayor. God, look at the shoes. What? Why? I'm not sure myself. Why do they look so good what compared to everything said? else? The whole town's living a carefree life, not knowing what's going on outside. What does that mean? Don't know. But after Blackstone Railroad went out of service, no one's left town. And it's not that they don't leave. They can't leave. The reason why the mayor doesn't open the gate must be so that people don't see the outside world. Yeah, I guess you're right. I'm going. Huh? Going? Where? You're not thinking of... Uh-huh. I'm leaving this town. Oh, hold on there. Seriously? But there's all kinds of weird creatures in the channel. I'll be fine. I usually use this to fix things, but it makes a pretty to good... To fix way. things! <laughs> <laughs> no use trying to stop you now. Hold on a sec. What the hell do you fix with a wrench that big? A gun. This is my baby, but you'll need him more. It gets a little rowdy around here, so this guy'll come in handy. Wow, really? That looks it's like okay? it. 
It's so Take inaccurate. It already. Thank you, Donnie. And with this one, we can keep in touch while you're in the channel. If you get lost, just give me a buzz. Gotcha. Watch yourself, Max. Yep. Donnie, Jump. I need you to keep an eye out for those guys here. No problem. Whatever you say. Huh? Hey, why do I have to stand watch? Max? Sorry, Donnie, but I want to see the outside world with my own eyes. Yeah, I, that's one of the things I need to do. I totally need to get this game with Japanese just Chapter to see how the voice acting is. To the outside world. I need to stop talking in the cutscenes. Uh, there aren't a lot of cutscenes later in the game, so I'll have room to talk. Just I got a lot of things to say about this game, you know. Bam! New chapter. talking about. I think the one in the channel's called the key handle. If you use the gate key on the exit for that floor, you can get to the next floor. Just keep doing that and you can get to the end of any dungeon. Got it, Max? Roger, Donnie. I'll give it a try. Roger, roger. Look at the map. Get the map. And that is how you kill enemies. Oh my god, that is rare. These boxes here, you can lift them up and throw them. Yeah. Trying to figure out the ultimate combo. Dungeons get bigger than this. Don't worry, they do. They also get creepier. Yeah. Yeah. One of the best things about opening these crates yeah. is that uh, they give you items too. Just not every time. But they can give you items that the chests don't. One of the things about the underground water channel chests is that they have a high chance of giving you really important items that you need a lot of. Because, you know, it's early in the game. The game wants you to have fun. But uh, later on, they're just like, nah, fuck you, dude. Fucking clowns, dude. It just backs up infinitely. Oh, 
Ha, I'm gonna lift you. Lift you and throw you into a gigantic rat. These, these, you spam really hard on these. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yep. Yes, you spam very hard. Okay, yep, time to heal. You take this, put that there. You press square. There's a fucking pole right there. <laughs> I have the actual most useless item in the game. You can't make anything with it. Don't you know gun beats knife? <laughs> Don't bring a knife to a gunfight. <laughs> One damage. Yeah, the guns aren't very ranged. That's the victory complete thing. I can't, I can't not skip that. Cause I've just seen it so many times, I'm not gonna watch it again. This is the magic crystal, isn't it? Yep. Basically, what it, uh, that is, is, um, shows you all the chests and the, and the enemies on the map. You know, the thing we already got all of. the underground channel. I had said I want to see the outside world to Donnie, but there was a second reason why I wanted to go there. Oh man, it's this cutscene. Your flounder, sir. Bon appétit. Max, where are your manners? Eat your dinner. Look at that fork and knife. It is huge. Also, he never actually eats the food. <laughs> um, Father? I'd like to ask you something. Yes? What? Well, about Mother. Where is she? Dramatic pan. I'm sure I told you this already. Your mother is doing important work far away from here. But what's the name of the town and what job is she doing there? It's nothing for you to worry about. Eat your dinner. <sighs> this is just how you always are. You don't tell me anything. Young sir! Would you like me to go after him, sir? Leave him be. It's too bad that maid, I don't think, has any lines. She is best character. Now, for the 
best part of the game. It's not the best part. So, this is the building up stuff. Um, each weapon has 10 stats. Every weapon. Um, you get them to a certain point, you can build them up. So, oh, and they also have a max specific stat. So, the battle range has like 30, I think. Anyway, so this needs to smash and beast to level up. Spectrumize these crystals. You get a bunch of them in the underground water channel. If it likes it. And, uh, we go over here and you just put it on the wrench. Put it on the wrench. There you go, you win. Also fire. This fire is a good element. And there's a specific way to level stuff up in this game. You want to level up your weapon as much as you can before you build it up, so you get bonus attack. Different enemies are uh, weak to you, different types of guns and ranges and stuff. Yeah. It's mostly just bats are weak to guns, and balloons are weak to guns too. See, how does balloon compare to gun? It don't. gun did not affect it. You know, this would be like the optimal range for a gun. Bomb nut. <laughs> nut. Pointless. The only thing you can really do canceling your attacks like that is keeping something really strong caught in the loop. It's only the final attack makes an enemy stop flinching. So of course this means you can just bop enemies forever. Is probably all common knowledge against the people that play this game. Gun. Some of the weapons, in, okay, for these, no matter what, you always pick Exploding Trap, even if it's the other ones, because if it's an Exploding Trap, then your chest dies. You don't give a shit. Weapon destroying traps don't matter. But yeah, this game has my favorite weapon system in any game ever.
also, the uh, effects for having separate elements on your weapon, uh, they grow based on- Oops. Yeah. I ran doing glitch. Um, every element has a different sort of effect if it's the highest yeah. thing. When you bop an enemy or something, like if it's if it's fire, then the enemy explodes into fire. Of course, it's not a damage over time or anything. It's just regular damage. It just does more based on the element. But um, they explode into fire for uh, chill. It's like a bunch of ice cubes pop out of the enemy. Wind is. Uh, Bunch of fucking leaves or something. I don't know, man. What freaking leaves. Oh, good. Leave those. But, um. Bats are weak to Cyclone and Beast because they are flying enemy. Flying enemy is weak to Cyclone and Beasts are, uh, are weak to Beast, you know. Like a normal. There's also lightning, which is effective against frogs. Because you know you can strike frog with lightning. Um So yeah, so you can build it up. You don't want to do that yet. So you max out the attack or don't want to level it up anymore. Also, synthesis points are important, so you want to level it up as much as you can. Is it raining? Oh man, I love rain. Rain is the best. So yeah, see how it's like level 3, you can level it up to true battle range. Don't do that yet. Level it up a few more times. Get it to like 5 or 6 or something like that before you level it up. Oh no, Ken is good at taking out flying targets. You know, flying targets are usually hard to hit. And it needs a lot of cyclone to level up the first time. Or to build up for the first time. But that doesn't matter because you okay. Cool! My voice already hurts. I've only been talking for like 30 minutes. underground channel ran on ahead in front of me. Yep. And as I pressed on, heading deeper, for some reason, thoughts of you, Mother, filled my head. <laughs> I don't remember your face now, Mother, even though I must have seen it so often when I was small. Dad doesn't keep any pictures of his mom. What the hell? Even the husband. Max, can you hear me? Max. No. No, I can't hear you. You can't hear me. He's currently locked in an animation that doesn't work. He cannot hear you. <laughs> How's it going? Maybe. Yeah, looks like I made it to the next floor. Tutorials in this game are the best thing ever. Now that we've unlocked them, we can look at them. So. Hey, I'm Donnie, and I'm gonna explain the basic controls in the dungeons. The X button is for using the weapon in your right hand. 
If you press the X button while holding down the L1 button, you'll attack with the projectile weapon in your left hand. If you hold down the X button for a long time, when you release it, you'll do a charge attack. Use it at critical moments. Dispatch the enemy. See if you can figure it out. <laughs> All right, rage counter. This one's important too. Do you know what the red bit is above the monster's HP bar? It's called the rage counter, and each time you attack a monster, it decreases by one. If you don't defeat the monster before it runs out, the monster will go into rage mode. If that happens, the monster will get a lot stronger, so you'd better not attack it half-heartedly with a weak weapon. This is true. And it's also dangerous when you attack an enemy that uh, you need a bigger thing to kill. Of course, I like doing that anyway, so I do it anyway. In a fight, you could be attacked by things like poison, which will put you in abnormal status. When you go into abnormal status, using normal recovery items like bread won't work. The only thing that will work for poison is the antidote drink. When you're in a particular abnormal status, you'll need the right item to let you recover. When fighting a monster that uses abnormal status attacks, you'd better get yourself a status recovery item before you go in guns a blazing. Icon descriptions. This is just a picture. Well, some pictures, I guess. Anyway, these are the status effects. can put on your weapon, except for the bad ones. Money enemies drop increases. Excuse me? Oh, okay. Wait, no, I'm an idiot. Yeah, see, I guess that's what you get for living under a rock your entire life. high damage. Dark is very good. Very, very good. Dark is amazing. You always want dark unless you're a little baby. Um, of course, if you have dark and absorb, it doesn't matter. Spoilers. Spoilers. Okay, this is another thing. There's also a lot of help. Okay, time to get on to the dungeon. Boxes. See that? See it up there? It's turtle. These things kick your ass. They are ruthless. Like, I'm not even kidding. These boxes are... Uh, let's see. Well, you know, I don't miss them, but I guess I got lucky with that turtle. Um, their attack is they spin at you. And there is no, um... 
no tell. They just start spinning and go at you immediately. So if you're right on the melee, then you take damage instantly. Also, these guys are hilarious. If they don't do anything. The spooky ghosts just, you know, sit there and take a hit until they die. So yeah, get used to a lot of this. Sometimes building, I guess. See item, it's probably bread. Yeah. Yep. See that was just me being an idiot. But um if you're right on them, they do that immediately. Boxes. These things drop very important items later in the game. Specifically, fuel for a certain thing that you may have or may have not have seen a spoiler for. When I was a kid, I had non-stop dreams about this game. And since I was not good at video games, they were always about the underground water channel. Because it took me like three months to get to the second chapter in this game. Oh, oh. Yeah, they do that too. They also spin. So many enemies that freaked me out, especially on this channel. Because when I was I was really young, I had nightmares about a specific enemy that you'll see later on. I thought the balloons were hilarious. So don't really These guys too, they they were hilarious. Which shall it be? Very good. I always pick the red box. Here you are. I mean, like I always, just always pick the red box. It doesn't matter. Later on to the game, the only thing you use the the, uh, the ride pod for is just moving around. It's just way faster than Max. Or Monica. The girl you first saw. Spoilers. Spoilers. You know, after I've already said the spoiler. <laughs> Spoiler warning, Max dies if he loses all of his HP. <laughs> oh man, lucky us. Which shall it be? Very good. Holy luck us. Okay, yeah, we're too lucky. Four viewers. Oh man. That's crazy. That is not what you use to open these doors. I remember trying to use a bomb <laughs> and I thought something funny was gonna happen. I was disappointed.
want to do that yet. So coming up is one of the most hilarious parts of the game. What's all this? I've hundred percent of this game before. It's hilarious. Because most of the time you spend is just doing levels Donnie, over and over again, trying to, to finish your time. There are also, high surf like tanks everywhere. Oh man, yeah, pictures too. But those are sort of easy because I've memorized just about everything about them. The pumps in there are used to draw water from the lake. Gotcha. Even by memorizing Thanks, the bookmark to a page with all of its stuff. <laughs> it's right there. The bookmark says inventions. <laughs> So how's your day? What the? Hi, Aaron. <laughs> oh, hello, Seraxis. A lot of people here. Thanks for t uh, thanks for sticking by. And how are we today, Matt? I'm quite proud of you for coming all this way through the sewer. By the way, Max, I took the liberty of doing a little research on you. For someone like you, living in a big house with no wants or needs. Don't you yeah, think you should you just look up the pictures. You your life away fighting us? Oh, I love this game. The only reason I'm streaming <laughs> it now is because I have nothing else to do, unfortunately. Childhood game, hell yeah. Want to know more, give me that red... Of course, when I was a kid, I was really bad at games, so I well, never really beat it. Until, no, um... No way. Until I grew a few years. I'll find my mother myself. And, uh, I don't figured out how to use online like guides. Ah, you stinking brat! You will regret this, I guarantee! Take care of them, my darling Linda! Yeah, this game is somewhat rewarding to play. Specifically, if you like getting uh, oh, well, I've been uh, I've invested. Anyway, this is an elephant that you're just gonna get hit through. Oh man! Oh boy! I cannot beat you. That's no good. I'll never win like this. I think rapidly vibrating in the background. Now then, Max. What will it be? Ah. Oh man, the mines. <laughs> I never actually beat those when I was a kid. Huh? I always got what? stuck on um the level that Max, first introduced right. the dude it's balloons, me. the green ones. Just, I didn't know how to block. Like if I'm if I'm being honest, I've never known how to block until like just a few years ago in this yep. game, which sounds ridiculous, doesn't it? But I would walk up to hit them, and they would just hit me for half my health, and I would get upset. Because <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> By the way, animal cruelty. Uh, no block pursuit. I should take that up. Just cancel my attacks with um with my gun. Just stun loop enemies. And make sure I never get hit. Um, I usually go wrenches because I love the combo that later on that it gets. What the? What's wrong? But sometimes, if I'm feeling like one shot the enemy, sometimes, 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 you know, sometimes I'll go sometimes hammer. I don't think you can handle any more fighting for now. Hop in, Max. Get on, but it can't move. Yeah. Don't you worry about that. There's enough <laughs> to get us back. Come on, get in. Running away, eh? The hammers are fun. Get back. Ah, wonky Wi-Fi memories. Adios. 
He casually walks away. Oh my, they've run off. They didn't I even run. Sparks. Just fly after them, dumb butt. There you go. Yeah. I'm running this game on an emulator, and don't worry, I bought the game multiple times. But um, this is the first time I've been able to run it upscaled. So I'm just now noticing how good Max's shoes look. Like, Morning, look at sunny. them. Sleep well. Look at those shoes right now. Yeah. Tell me, Cedric, why do you think those circus goons are after this pendant of mine? Who knows, kid? But if what you overheard in that room at the circus is true, then Mayor Need definitely knows something. I'll talk to Need and like, see if I can get anything out of him. Just I don't, don't know why, but that actually looks like it might hands, be the best no thing in the game. What. Best looking thing in the game. I know. I won't give this up. Well, um, it's mostly because it's associated with piracy and stuff like that. Alrighty then. This thing here is the problem. But um, I guess people do have their reasons. So elephant. like, it's okay if you if you're using an emulator and you've bought the game before, and it's especially okay, considered morally right, if you get the ISO from the disc itself. All you need is an energy pack, right? Yep. Well, Cedric, how about letting me handle that? The only reason I am using an emulator. It's because my discs are broke, broken multiple times. But, yeah, I wanna um, give it a try. now that I've got a brand new computer with that's, that's like, you know, really good, I figure, hey, I've beaten this game before, why not just, you know, try it again in an upscaled resolution? And right now I'm on 4X upscaled and it looks amazing. Hmm. Except for the pixely text, as you know. Yeah, emulators right, are then. very, very convenient. The job's yours. Alright! And one of my you know, favorite things about the, uh, pretty tough work. the PS2 you emulator how, Sonny, so you listen carefully. Okay. is uh, messing it with all the settings and trying to fix all the stupid graphical glitches. <laughs> it's like one of my favorite things ever. To create something new. It took me a while to fix the, um, the text in this game because without a few hardware hacks, it gets these weird umlauts or whatever around the certain characters. And there's also a bunch of lines going through everything. And ideas are, well, Unfortunately, I couldn't, mix, or couldn't fix most of the graphical yeah. errors, some hints on making an but I've got it pretty can. damn close to being as good as it can be. Pipes and a belt. Now this is where... Next, first, press the square button to ready the camera. Then, and to take... Okay, we got the camera. I'm not, I'm, I, I don't care about this. I don't care about this guy. I really don't. Okay. Now, for uh, half of the game right here. Yeah, one of the hacks that I have makes the um, health bars sort of blend into each other. But it fi it's better than head, better than nothing. It really is. But, uh, <laughs> it, the end game stuff looks really nice. Oh jeez. Vacuum. Clock. Arm. Arm. I said arm. Oh, come on. Oh yeah. Because people, most of the time, they don't really know what's going on in emulators. No offense or anything. Hey, Cedric. I'm not taking a picture of you. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, there's another game that I like to emulate. Um, it was another one of my childhood games that I used to play. It took me three years to beat, by the way. Three entire years. I am not joking. But, um... That is not a rapper, that is a trumpet. With it... With the ball at the end. Why is there a ball at the end? Um, Neopets The Darkest Fairy. Which is apparently the worst game in the world to run casually. Oh, it just changed the times. It's brighter now. 
Yes, Cedric is. Also, hi, Ants Cuddle Buddy. How you doing today? <laughs> Get a picture of him down here. Yeah, that game is ridiculously bad. It's it's nothing but it's a walking simulator. I'm just gonna describe it like that, a walking simulator. Anyway, just save the ideas and stuff like this, that's how I do it. So, go down here and take more pictures, and we'll be done in here, we'll have all the pictures. Neopets the Darkest Fairy. I will stream it eventually. But I'm probably not going to stream most of the, uh, you know, long boring parts that I, you know, usually just walking. You know what? I might actually just, like, cheat in. Unfortunately, I think I'm just going to cheat in a bunch of America Speed potions because running or playing that game without those is, is torture. Of course, I was a kid at the time, so I didn't really know. God, it's... I wish I could use this game with a mouse. I really do. Yeah, cats usually don't like being held. You have to raise them specifically to be okay with being held if you want to hold them. From what I understand. Anyway, we have to walk up here and take a picture of this guy's, uh, pants. Hey dude, pose for me. Alright, let me get closer. And, uh, just, po <laughs> just pose for me, please. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, anyway, pipes. Sign. Pipes. And others come something an agreement. That's the first time I've actually been able to read that sign. <laughs> yeah, it's not weird. Not weird at all. Where is the sign? There we go. Oh man, the first game. I, um... I remember playing the second game first. And after the second game broke the first time because I was a really, really was a little kid. Uh, I didn't know how to take care of games. But uh, after I let it break the first time, I thought Dark Cloud was the game. I didn't notice there was a 2 at the... My favorite chapter? Um... My favorite chapter would have to be... Vinicio. Chapter 4. Chapter 4 is my favorite. Vinicio, Vinicio. I don't know how to pronounce it, actually. I'll have to look it up later. So yeah, run around Palm Brinks taking pictures of everything. Yeah. I really enjoyed Vinicio. The first time I got there, again, I was a kid. And I was like, wow, wee! Look at this place. It is an ocean. May not have been exactly what I said, but you know. Vinicio. Okay. So, uh, 
Let's see if I can remember this. Tree. Hi, Murata. Oh, no good, huh? Yeah. Time Rada is really good. I like its music a lot. And its level is one of my favorites too. It's really easy to look at. Anyway. Hey, we just made the second tier uh, power pack. Yeah, Ninja pack. it works! <laughs> what a surprise. That is not the right one. Um, I have tried. I really, I really have tried getting that first. But, um... It won't let you. You have to make the first one. <laughs> Which sucks. <laughs> uh, I remember most inventions. Like, I remember Cedric's shop sign, um, Crescent Light and something else mixed, like the Eggman body. Uh, I remember how to make the Mobius loop, which is like a clock. Something else. Uh, it's really fuzzy. Because I haven't played this game in a while, but yeah. Oh man, not being able to reorder the inventions. That sucks. I all Okay, so another thing you can do is uh, press L2, R2, and stuff like that. Oh, uh, um, I... I don't bother with most of the inventions except for the ride bot inventions because they're the only things you need to care about inventions wise because the rest is just garbage. The final boss is a monster? Well, I can't say I haven't tried that before. But the thing is, y you can't damage it. <laughs> Um, anyway, belt, milk can, pipe. Anyway, that's the energy pack. Yeah. Yes, it does, Surfing Master. Yes, it does. Um, I remember reading something about a third game being in the works, but I might be wrong. Because, um... Didn't they re-release this game, Dark Cloud 2, on the PS4? Like an HD remake? Donkey Kong 3. <laughs> yeah, it would. I bet it would be called Dark, or Dark Chronicle 2. In other regions. It's fine, don't worry about it. game by level 5. Is it that one, um... It's, it's something to do with witches, isn't it? Thoughts on the name tape? The buggiest item in the game? Oh yeah, it's, it's pretty fun. Cause, uh... <laughs> you, can just, you can just name a wrench. Legend. And it turns into a legend. Yeah, I've tried uh, going back into the. Or I've tried farming ten rolling logs and a bunch of scrap and metals. Yeah, white witch or something. Yeah, I remember seeing that game. Um, basically, any game that had Tomohito Nishira do the score for, I've heard of at least. I don't think White Witch has a score by a score from him. But yeah, I've tried making this first. Doesn't work. It sucks. Yes, haha. <laughs> it would be the buggy. 
Man, have I, really, have I really been playing for an hour now? Huh. Fortnite. Is it by level 5? I haven't been really keeping up with most stuff, news and stuff like that. I've done it, Cedric! This cutscene never happens, and without this cutscene happening and stuff like that. Oh boy! I time. knew you had it in you. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, I did start playing instantly. So you think you understand the invention process now? I usually start yes. up the game, make sure everything's working before I start streaming. Unlike other people. From now on, you gotta <laughs> use your own <laughs> noggin, find your own building blocks, and make your own. Yes, I will use my own noggin, and by that I mean I will open a tab labeled invention. Okay. Max. Okay, we have the ride pod. We also have a camera, which is much more important than the ride pod. You all. Okay. All right. All right. So first thing we need to do this. Yeah, uh, skip this cutscene because I'm tired of watching cut. Oop. What the hell? Yeah, you do. What happened? What was that? I opened like a menu by hitting the main button on my controller. I hope it's not doing anything now. Oh, we have to climb. Huh. Nowhere. And again, I forgot to open Streamable Streamlabs. Huh? Uh Right there. <laughs> I bet you were thrilled when you thought you were alone here. Um I'll be honest, I'm probably gonna Too bad. So so Um I'm probably gonna stream this game. Till the end now that I have some people watching me. So yeah, I'm probably not going to be the most consistent with time. By the way, fastest access is the best thing ever in this game. Because switching characters doesn't take forever. Oh, come on. Oh. I hate getting the screenshot. <laughs> Am I doing it wrong? Oh, jeez! Come on. Oh, got it. Alright. Time for animal abuse. This would not fly. Uh, no, I'm using an Xbox controller. Because my PS3 controller got wrecked. And by got wrecked, I mean it dropped off of my desk a few too many times. You did it, Max. You beat up an elephant. Look at that satisfaction on his face. My heart was filled with expectation, wondering what kind of places I would find. I had no idea that the incredible adventure I was about to begin was beyond anything that I could have imagined. But yeah, I'll probably stream this tomorrow at like a random time depending on what's convenient for me. So yeah, you can go ahead and stick around. Because, you know, I'll stream it tomorrow, I promise. I promise! I'll write something on my desktop that says Stream Dark Club 2 tomorrow. Or today. I should write it stream today, because <laughs> if I say tomorrow, I'm gonna be like, oh, I, have to, I can do it tomorrow. So anyway, yeah. There we go. Switching it up, boys.
love the music on this stage. It's one of my favorite tracks in this game. Even though it's kind of short. Uh, no, I do not have a PS4. Hey, Cedric! I figured it would be a waste of money, because, you know, I don't really want to play anything on it. Except for Kingdom Hearts 3, All but right, that's not coming out yet. What exactly are you hiding from me? Tell me everything you know. By the way, thank you for the follow, Surfing Master. <laughs> Let me just go ahead and play that again. See, so you realize too, have you? <laughs> Why are you hiding things from me? I thought we were friends, Need. What's going on? Spit it out, will you? I'm gonna put okay, OBS in my okay. second monitor. I can't go on hiding it anymore. I'll tell you everything. Yeah. I'll tell you what's going on here in this town. Yeah, 2020. In this world. 2020 is gonna be the memeiest year ever. I swear it will be. Trailer, Fortnite. Okay, I will after I'm finished streaming. I'm probably going to stream for a few more hours, maybe complete the underground channel, stuff like that. But, um... Alright, so, Steve's Battle. Uh, we're not going to use the ride pod on this stage. Because, you know, I love doing ride podless playthroughs. <laughs> the ride pod is such a piece of crap. I'm sorry. I just don't like it at all. But, um... The enemy that this game wants you to fight with the ride pod with, the, uh the vanguard or whatever, there is a scoop that you get when he does like that flippity do attack. You have to, right as he's upside down, you have to snap a picture of his head. Um, wow, I'm unlucky with these today. But right as he does a flip, you have to take a picture of him, which is really dumb because yeah. nine times out of ten, you will get hit. And if you try to do it this early without any defense ups, it's just suicide. Like, I'm pretty sure that attack does like 16 or something damage. So, that is a really dumb scoop to try and get. Clown! I got hit. I'm bad. I've played this game for thousands of hours. Anyway, right there, Vanguard. Yep, don't try and get the scoop. I'm going to die. <laughs> okay, this was a bad idea. <laughs> uh, um, I'm not gonna get it right now because I've already enraged him. But yeah, that's the combo. If my wrench had more durability... Anyway, these guys spin. Yeah, the rage bar. If, we, if that runs out, the enemies get double damage and they attack faster. And that's what happened to me when I <laughs> tried to yeah. fight the thing without the ride pod. I broke my wrench on him and almost died. I'm in it. Man, I am just off of my game today, aren't I? Alright, so yeah, how you're supposed to fight these guys is just get your ride pod, smack them up. There, he's dead. 
Honestly, it's a huge, <laughs> it is a huge waste of time if you don't have fast access. Or fast dicks. Fast disc access. <laughs> uh, the best costume? I like the Explorer costume a lot. It's always been my favorite. But, uh, I don't know how to start with it. Like, I recall something about just unlocking the outfit for the first time. But I guess I'll have to unlock it the legit way. Which is with medals. Anyway, open up chests from behind all the time. Mimics used to scare me so bad. They really did. They were my wor they were the worst thing forever for me when I was a kid. I hated them. Especially in Dark Cloud 1. Oh my goodness. That and they're really hard to fight in Dark Cloud 1. Anyway, yeah, since I'm running uh, out of unlock costumes, the Explorer outfit you buy from me uh, buy with medals from Marineid. But who does that? Who does that when there's a Panther outfit from Monica? Which you buy from <laughs> buy with medals from Need. Panther outfit is the best outfit ever. My goodness, the grind in, the, in that game. Yeah, I like Panther because I'm really weird. Oh man, I'm glad my bathroom door. <laughs> it's lewd. It's a lewd outfit. Why Marineid has it, I'll never know. Wait, no, you get the Explorer outfit from Donnie, not Marineid. Marineid sells the clown outfit. But yeah, Scoops. Scoops and Donnie gives you the Explorer outfit. Our palace. Do you not like that area? Um, armbands are usually the last thing I bother with because I really dislike them. Guns are fun, especially the machine guns. So I'm probably gonna try and get a machine gun as soon as I can. Uh, fun fact, these rooms here, the chest with their key can spawn inside of them. Let me smash. <laughs> Anyway, so what I like to do with the battle wrench, the first battle wrench we get, is just level it up to six or seven. You know, get as many stats as I can on it before I level it up. Because, you know, the stats on this weapon, they usually cap at around 19, I'm pretty sure. Uh, for this gun, this gun is ridiculous. I hate it. I hate the starting gun so much. It is the worst thing ever. Definitely because it needs so much cyclone. You have to run the first stage like a few times to try and finish it. I hear Vanguard. Here, check this out. Bet you didn't know the right mod to kick. Ah, I'm not getting close to it. Kicked. You can do that with certain ride pod legs. The 
course, with Max it's faster to just do that. For Monica, though, it's really slow to pick up rocks, and I've always hated that. Because on the red seals, like, I'm, I am a, I am a completionist. I have to do every stage I do 100% or else something just irks me. But, um, for some reason, Monica just has a really slow, like, lifting animation. It's awful. And it's, it's a reason why I hate the red seals so much. Another thing is, the first red seal in the the, the, uh, the the rainbow butterfly wood, it's a bunch of turtles. And at the time, Monica has like no good weapons to fight turtles with, so you just have to buy a bunch of bombs and hope you don't run out. So, there it is. <laughs> That's what this is all about. You know what I do on golf? You expect me I use to save states because I am a cheaty mess when it comes to golf. So I really just do use save state. On doing, huh? Well, there's nothing that I can do. You ignoramus. What's wrong with you? You're supposed to be the mayor of this town. Uh, you're right, I'm useless as mayor. Come on, Need, what happened? You didn't used to be like this. Mm. Gosh darn it, Need, I just can't believe you. That's it! Need, just start the Blackstone Railroad again. Yeah, Need. Blackstone Railroad? The reason you shut down the Blackstone Railroad was so that no one could leave and see the outside world, right? Yeah, you can't save state on stuff like well, that. Well, that's not necessary anymore. On emulators... Now we need to leave this town and see the outside world. On emulators, hmm. I set up a hotkey on my keyboard, which is Come basically on. save state and load state. You know, usually. Usual stuff. And uh, right before I make a shot, right. I will Let's save, reopen save the state. Railroad. And then, yeah, diamond ears, look at that. <laughs> but yeah, right as, right before I make a shot, I'll save a state, and if I mess up the state, um, or if I mess up the shot, or don't get like the perfect Everything shot, set? I'll just redo it over and over again. Set, this Henry. has, of course, you know, the usual human thing, has made me very good at it. It's a go! Great to be back, isn't it, sir? Yeah, 20% more cold today! Roger that! This game would be a thousand times better if that character on the right was a girl. Named Ed. Blackstone One. Here we go. Uh, I'll be right back. I need to turn on my AC. And by turn on, I mean leap at the ceiling until I can. Open the vent. <laughs> yeah, it's not a girl. I guess I didn't have the guts. Fine. Okay, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save because I'm bad at this game. Sweet scary treasure chest. I have always hated this song. It used to scare me so much. Like, cause you gotta remember, when I was a kid, uh, I played this game nonstop. So, uh, when I was a kid, I played this game nonstop. And eh, stick my in my lips. But yeah. When I was a kid, I put this game out. Stop. I always hated the fight. These! These enemies are the ones that scared the hell out of me.
The chest was empty. Speedy spawn. Yeah. Rip. Man, you know what I miss? Auto repair powder. Yeah, already I already miss it. Is that a thing in this game? I never, I never remember yeah. seeing that. <laughs> like I always. I really just like uh, not liking this song because it's such a good song. Ah, oh, rip. Anyway, king mimics are easy because <laughs> they don't break your wrench. Yeah, it seems like an even trade. That is a good idea. I should hot bar without powder. This song was especially scary to me when it played on the last level of the Rainbow Butterfly Forest. Because it was always raining and there were always sonic booms everywhere. And those big enemies with the, the with the spiky hands, enemies like that, that I need the right bot to fight, they always were like, they were my kryptonite when I was a kid. I really, really disliked them. Combat, not so much. But yeah, it's a pretty nice game. A lot of features are easy to figure out. At the core, of course, it's not like a MOBA game where you just 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 like fucking drowned in things. Like, oh hey, check this out and check this out. Uh, here's a hot bar for your um, uh, 187 abilities. I gotta stop smacking my lips. I need something to drink. Warm. That was not refreshing. I need to go get more water. Futurama is great. It's a great show. Very good. I remember watching. Uh, Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought you were making a joke. <laughs> ah, man, rip me. So, usually, what I like to do. Yeah, Futurama is a really bad anime. So what I like to do before I go ahead and finish up the first stages is I will do the um, I'll do the first stage 
a few more times just to get some crystals. Then I'll try and use my gun so I can get more synthesis points. My gun! Since um, the first level chests have a really high chance of having a crystal in them, you know, like that. Sometimes you'll even get, like, on the second or third levels, you'll get lucky and there'll be a clown. And um, if you pick the red chest, like, all the time, you'll get a coin from it. Which shall it be? Very good. This better let me go all the way to 18 or else I'm going to be upset. Okay, good. Anyway, just go ahead and throw a bunch of stats on weapons before you level them up or build them up. Because later on in the game, the more stats your weapons have when you level it up, Past five, it will level up a random one of these stats. For every five levels, another random one of these stats will get another stat. Or uh, an additional stat. So like at five, for five levels, you get one random stat. Or after ten, you get two in each one of these. Or two in a random one of these, I think. This is what I remember anyway. And it could just uh, scale with how good your weapon is too. So yeah, go ahead and just throw a bunch of random stats on the weapons. True battle wrench, yeah. Yeah, I know, don't worry. Yep, that's exactly what I was planning, don't worry. That's fine. I like having people talking to me in my chat. It's awesome. Yeah, so after I um, after I finish chapter one, get to chapter two, I'm probably gonna call it a day. But don't worry, I'll try and do chapter two tomorrow. I really will. Silly clowns. Knife does not beat gun. Yeah, there you go, gun gameplay. In case you missed it. Yeah. 
I kind of do hope we get lucky and get an indestructible coin for our wrench. But, uh, since I might go hammers, my favorite weapon, um, it'd have to be one of Monica's swords. I think the short sword, or like the Muramasa. One of those weapons, because I love the combo on it so much. By the way, for these, I always pick exploding. In case you didn't know. Island King. Oh yeah, <laughs> stat-wise it's the best sword in the game, but god, it is just so uh, gaudy. My Gucci sword. Oh hey, hey, gimme, gimme, gimme coin. Rip. I got bread instead of coin. There have been people on YouTube that have um, farmed the first level so much that they got a digi hammer. Which sounds crazy, yeah, I know, but they did that. And they one shot the boss. I can't remember exactly, but it's somewhere on YouTube. I smell like soap. Oop. Yep, people have. People have done it. Crazy. Yep. Just right before, like where I'm at right now, they would farm until they got a digi hammer. It's like those crazy people that tried getting level 100 and um, or have gotten level 100 in Final Fantasy 7. You know, like at the first area. Nice. <laughs> we did it, guys. <laughs> Man, who would eat bread that's been in the sewer for how for who knows how long? For who knows how long? See that bullet curve into it? Bullets don't do that. Yeah. Well, I mean, they do in Halo. Because, <laughs> you know, nano machines. A hard attack? Wait, what are we talking about? I lost track. Oh yeah, those, okay.
Look at these boxes. They probably only have bread in them. Or gun repair powder. I can be wrong, see? Look at all that bread. I got a bunch of messages. Uh, give me a sec, I gotta check them. Alright, sorry about that. Discord, stuff like that. You know, regular biz. Where the exit is. Look at where the exit is and where I'm at at the uh, where I'm on at the map. Where I'm at on the map. The exit's right there, right? Where does the door go? Rubik's Cube 100 XS? Is that like a crazy big Rubik's Cube? Or am I just dumb? Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna talk about this. I um, I sometimes I will mess around with the stats in this game, the cheat engine because it's on an emulator. And uh, if you try and get your flame, chill, cyclone, lightning stuff like that past 255, the effect gets marginally bigger. Like it gets so big, it takes it's like the entire skybox. Um, another thing is if you try to mess with the stats on right pod weapons, like making them too big. Oh, this one's knocking. Uh, who's there?
Okay, I'm really sorry about that. Somebody needed my help. I saved, right? Okay, yeah. Really sorry about that. But, uh... We're gonna go ahead and do the boss. Finish chapter one, and I guess I'll be done. It's, it's getting kind of time for me to quit talking so much because my voice is starting to die. Oh. I think the exit should be around here somewhere. Anyway, time for an important picture that is really stupid to get. There we go. It was worth getting hit by a fucking rocket. Man, I smell burning plastic. It's not like a beer. Nice camera. Oh, the stupid thing about that boss is, uh... You have to take a picture as it recombines, so you have to fail the, uh... You have to fail the part where you smack the little butterflies. And there you go, that's how you kill this boss. You can kill it another way by throwing its robot bombs at it. But I don't do that, because I'm lazy. Man, why do I smell burning plastic? I, ho I really hope it's not my computer. Okay, I'm just gonna skip a bunch of cutscenes because it's getting time for me to have to go. To have to go. Okay, yeah, it's my controller. It's starting to smell like plastic. It's probably not a good thing. We are being attacked. But, uh, my photography level increased at least. Uh, hey, pose for me, boy. Anyway, save. Uh, uh, I'm not going just yet. I still have to get to chapter two. So we'll start. We're still gonna fight this. <laughs> Set. Oh, well, you can throw the bombs onto the train, and it does do damage. Anyway, that's chapter one. Glad you guys stuck around for, for that long. Um... I'm just gonna skip this cutscene. Chapter two, resurrection of the great elder. 
Man, I have so many Steven Universe jokes for this next chapter. You have no idea. Anyway, let's start. Let's with see how fast we switch between Max and Monica. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna save and I'm gonna go ahead and hop off for now. Later, everybody. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.